G'day there, welcome to this Mark's Reviews and Tutorials video. So I've got here a procedure for you for how to bed in brakes. A lot of people are doing their own brakes these days. I've got videos up showing people how to do that. But the proper procedure, as recommended by the brake companies uh, for how to bed in, is just here. I'm going to read through it. Here it is. Increase speed to 40. This is when you're first starting off. Put brakes on lightly, reducing speed down to 20. And uh, increase speed to 60. Put brakes on lightly, reducing speed down to 40. So you can see you're getting a little bit um, faster there. Then increase speed to 80. Put brakes on lightly, reducing speed down to 60. So here we go. Now 50 miles an hour. G is 80, by the way. So 40 is 25 miles an hour is 40. Drive for a while at 60, letting the brakes cool down. Absolutely important when they're brand new. Apply brakes lightly at 60, reducing speed to 40. Drive for a while at 40, letting the brakes cool down a little bit again. Apply brakes lightly at 40, reducing speed down to 20. So you're back down to the soft stuff now. Increase speed slowly to 60. Slowly, because you don't know your brakes are fully there with you yet, so you don't go ripping around. Apply brakes lightly at 60, reducing speed down to 40. Increase speed to 60, drive for a little while, then apply brakes, reducing speed to 40. Repeat previous step two more times. That's step 10. That's the 60 down to 40. Drive for two to three minutes without braking to cool brake components before parking. So you let the whole thing down before you go and rip the handbrake on and um, let it go at parking. So there it is, that's a 10 minute bedding in procedure and that's the procedure, I'll put it like that so that you can um, pause the video, read through, take notes, whatever. But uh, that's a good bedding in procedure to get your pads. And also be gentle for the first couple of days, realizing that you've got brand new pads in there and they're still mating up. If you've got brand new rotors and brand new pads, they'll both be flat. But if, for instance, you put pads onto old rotors, then there might be a little bit of evening out that needs to take place as well. So there you go. Thanks for watching.